Hey guys, this is Gray Mouse One. I just wanted to do a real quick video on the recent announcement of the PlayStation 4 being backwards compatible with PlayStation 1 and PlayStation 2 games. Uh, my thoughts are this. I really think that this is just a gimmick. The only reason why the PlayStation brand is doing this is because of the backwards compatibility function with the Xbox One to the Xbox 360 games. Uh, here recently, Xbox has announced that over 100 games are backwards compatible with the Xbox One, and that's great. Um, the problem with the PlayStation 4 being backwards compatible with the PlayStation 1 and PlayStation 2 games are that I feel that most people that own the PlayStation 1 and PlayStation 2 consoles would pretty much rather uh, play those games on said systems. Now, I understand that it makes it easier for everybody so you don't have to drag out your PlayStation 1 or PlayStation 2 to play your games anymore. Uh, right now, we're at the beginning of the announcement, so we don't know how many games are going to be available once this functionality has been added to the PlayStation 4. So, the only gripe that I have with this is that it completely skipped the PlayStation 3 generation. Um, I understand that uh, the PlayStation 3 wasn't the greatest system under the PlayStation brand. And the PlayStation 2, I believe, hands down, is and forever will be. Um, but for some, may have a different opinion on that. But I believe that, uh, that it was a good idea, but it's a novel idea. Um, I believe that uh, PlayStation would have done better if they would have included the uh, PlayStation 3 games as well. Then the ball would be in Microsoft's court again, and they will have to come up with something better to top the, uh, the PlayStation backwards compatibility. But if this was PlayStation's answer to the backwards compatibility of the Xbox One and the Xbox 360 games, I don't think that this was a very good answer, to be honest with you. Um, and the fact that they skipped the third generation of uh, PlayStation is just mind-blowing. I'm really not sure why they did that. They should have figured out some way. I know that they've gone on uh, and said that it's virtually impossible because of the hardware issues and, and the uh, other issues that that may cause. But um, I just don't really think that the PlayStation, it was a good idea that the PlayStation did this. Um, however, you know, uh, however, there are those that think that this is great news. Uh, and, you know, like I said, you know, I'm not saying this is the worst of news, but this is just my opinion. And, and I said my opinion, and I really do think that this was just a gimmick and nothing more. Um, we'll see. I'll definitely keep an eye out for more news about the backwards compatibility. Uh, and I would truly love to hear from you in the comments below with your opinions. And uh, it'd be great to hear from you. So until next time, this is Grey Mouse One.